Just when fans thought they couldn't be more excited for the new season of The Flash, the CW announced the series would be getting a big bad blast from the future, courtesy of the hero's nemesis, the reverse Flash. Viviana Vigil has inside access to the man behind the mask. Matt Lesher, the talk of Comic-Con this year. I'm so glad you're here. Oh, thank you. I'm so glad to be here. Uh, the Flash doing so well in the CW. Yes. And the Comic-Con fans were ecstatic that you were coming back as a reverse Flash. Yeah. What does that mean? Because you got to tell all of us non-Comic-Con people. Oh, God, that's a great <laughs> question. These shows are so unlike other shows. It's like state secrets. But I do know that I'm coming back uh, specifically in response to the events at the end of season two. Barry has altered the timeline, and now we've got to go back and try and make it work out. He needs my help for that. This isn't your home, Barry. It's a mirage. The Reverse Flash is one of the Flash's arch enemies and is the big baddie in another CW show, Legends of Tomorrow. This is one of the rare roles as an actor where the fans actually might know more about this character than you do stepping in. I guarantee they know way more about this character than I do. What's something they clued you into? One of the main things to know about this guy is he comes from the 25th century. I mean, he's 500 years ahead of where we are now. He's all about trying to neuter the timeline as it exists and create a completely different future. Guess what, Flash? I know what time period you're from. So that means you will die. Well, will the reverse Flash succeed in his evil plot? <laughs> You'll have to turn into the Flash on the CW.